microwave and run? Huh? Huh? <laughs> um, I get from people when I am running along and they don't have much time to say something as I'm blazing by them sometimes, or they're blazing by me, they go, good job. Very short. When they have a little bit more time, uh, things are slowed down. They'll say, keep up the good work. And I just got that a moment ago. Just wanted to share that with you. Uh, this isn't something I'm getting paid for, <laughs> by all means. This is quite voluntary. Um, so, it, but it is a job. It's it's a hard job. It's as hard as any job out there, and I know because I've worked quite a few. Uh, <laughs> as I often tell people, it seems like you got you, you worked every possible job. I think I've worked every possible job in my life. Um, delivered papers. Cleaned in banks, cleaned in milk plants, delivered pizza, oh, what else? Warehouses. Uh, I was a supervisor, I was a manager, I helped run a business, I sat at board meetings, you know, discussing the future of the business. I, oh, worked at the Calgary Zoo. <laughs> I talked, to, I talked to Justin Trudeau while I was at the Calgary Zoo. That's a whole other story. Um, and my, my life, my life, I've gone so, so, so far. And I gotta give a card out here. <laughs> it, was it, this is what your milk is supplying. It's causing, causing me to be able to uh, go so many kilometers. I'll, I'll give you that. I often buy milk from this guy <laughs> when I'm down here running. <laughs> take care, take care. It's my the supplier of my chocolate milk. <laughs> uh, he's been running this little hair. I'll poke poke to it. He's been running um, this little place here for ever. So you know, even if I wanted some fresh fruit or something along the way. When I first came along to Eau Claire, this all used to be market, and you, uh, it was great. Like, I mean, fresh fruit yeah, sh shops, little kiosks. You could just go in and out and in and out all over the place here, and it was much like this. Now, I think we're kind of left to little shops like this at Eau Claire, which is still great, but unfortunately we don't have more. But yeah, this is his shop, and I, I come in here often and I uh, yeah, ice cream. Yeah. Right in that co in that Coca-Cola machine there <laughs> is my chocolate milk. <laughs> but that's <laughs> I actually got, I bought a a liter and a half of it from him today. <laughs> um, so River Own Claire, it's a great little shop to go in. But uh, yeah, that's what's supplying it. What was I even talking about there? <laughs> I was distracted by chocolate milk, but um, <laughs> I don't even know what I was chatting about. Whew. But I probably said enough of it anyways, whatever that was. But uh, it's it's nice to get out and get down. I'm sitting probably about 15 kilometers now. Uh, I, may, I may add another 12 or so to it by the end of it. But uh, I think what I was talking about was jobs. <laughs> but yes, I did have a lot of jobs. But this is uh, a job made easier with finding your supplies. You know, your <laughs> your what, your chocolate milk. <laughs> but um, yeah, this is definitely a, a long, difficult job. And um, as you seen earlier, I've got the insurance. So I'll be going into. I might even set up right here myself. You know, somewhere in the middle. Um, I'll look at that maybe within a month here. Uh, I've got the insurance, come down, I might even, there's a room at the far, far end down there. Um, community room that I could see about, see about organizing something for that as well, but we'll see. So the insurance is there. Uh, it's a matter of signing things up and even though I'm already in here talking to people, uh, to actually set up a position and uh, I guess a table or something here and chair would be good. 
and a few other moments. So. And that's just a meet, greet, and talk to people, so which will be absolutely terrific. So, anyways, I am going to head and get out and get going, and head home. But uh, it sure was nice to jog along with folks tonight, and I did snap a photo at the end, so uh, it's a good looking photo. It's a they, I mean, they were good looking folks with me tonight. <laughs> me out there in front with my big ugly noggin. But, <laughs> anyways, uh, <coughs> I will add tomorrow. I hope I'm not going to be looking too much different than I do today. There, this um, eye here, I've got an issue underneath it. And uh, they're going to do a little snip and see what's going on there, send it away to a lab, and we'll look at it. So, hopefully, you know, I'm hoping things go good. Uh, Cause I don't, I don't want to be looking all weird or whatever. But you know, uh, we'll see how it goes. But anyways, uh, that's it—the ups, the downs, and the in betweens. But uh, that's life. There's valleys, there's plateaus, and there's also mountains. And uh, there's also blue sky ahead. So I think I'll just head out, <laughs> head out and look at the blue sky. <laughs> through both eyes anyways folks uh, remember the more you move the more you move others and doors like this need to be a thing of the past uh, where there should be a button pushed and you can just <laughs> go out normally people in wheelchairs they have more of a tough time or crutches, or canes. But anyhow, here's the sunshine, here's the blue sky, and here's me wishing all the best for this eye. Catch you on the balance, folks.